I'm sorry again that did that film in any case hello everybody my computer happens to be extremely slow lately I don't know what's wrong with it again but that means that every time I'm recording with the inbuilt camera it sort of freezes when I'm saying hello so that's why I would feel a bit awkward if I didn't say hello to you guys but yeah Anyways, I've been super busy and that's why I haven't done any videos or posted any blog because frankly, yeah, it's been a bit hectic and I'm really trying my best to revise for this exam, which is in 11 days. It's not really going that well, but yeah, we'll do it what we'll have, right? And if I don't pass, then I'll keep trying. It's not the end of the world. Just keep going. Anyways, uh, what's new with me? Um, I went to the Arctic Circle for Easter. We went there for two days. I snowboarded for my first time. I really loved it, but now the weather is not anymore for snowboarding because it's getting really warm or warmish. Uh, plus five degrees here, it's pretty warm considering what it's been in the past three weeks. And I got my nails done. First time I've been, I've gone with the stiletto. Um, I'm not sure if you can see that. Let's see, like this. It's just basically nude with some sequins. They're gel nails. Um, oh, and the um, hand cream I'm holding is the Sea Buckthorn hand cream from Valida. And I absolutely love it. It smells citrusy. It's just so so nice and um, this is the color it has and um, even though it's not i would i wouldn't say it's the most moisturizing hand cream i've ever tried but it feels nice in the hands and it's refreshing and i think it's nice if you're typing on the computer or on the computer all the day you keep that one by your side because it absorbs really quickly and dries so it doesn't uh, feel greasy in a while, but what I've noticed is that it, if you pull on too much, it kind of makes some residue or something, which is the downside of it. But yeah, anyways, that's, you have to live with it. Uh, what else? Mm, anything new? No, actually not really. I don't think there has been... Oh, I finally bought the Kiehl's BB cream because I really love it and I don't know, there is some SPF and vitamin C and blah 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 and ever since I've been using it, my skin has gone lighter because I don't know why, don't ask me. I've been using other sunscreens before, I didn't get this effect, but anyways, right now Pretty much all my foundations are too dark for me, which is a little bit annoying. But right now, so you get an idea, um, around an NW06 or 07. I'm not sure if, no, the camera won't pick it. But does it pick it with the white? No, it makes the white fluorescent. But anyways, yeah, the foundation I'm using today, it's dark or darkish, but I don't really mind. It's not that dark or that obvious, especially because I'm gonna pull my uh, zipper up so you can't really see it. And my ears are red, so it doesn't really bother me. But, oh yeah, what I'm wearing today is the Hourglass uh, Illusion Tinted Moisturizer. It's my all-time favorite tinted moisturizer. I went on the holiday trip and I only brought that one and my Tom Ford stick foundation. Those two are my go-to right now and they've, been, and they've been for a while. And also the Kiehl's BB cream, I really love it. I can apply it as a primer or I can apply it on its own. It has really good coverage. Again, if you're a bit paler than NW, what do we say, 15, you might notice it's not that pale. But it's not something that it's noticeable when you blend it on your skin, or at least not to me. Um, but yeah. What else? Mm -mm 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 -mm. I 
think that's it. I'm sorry guys. I, I know that I'm really boring, but I just wanted to make a quick-ish video. Oh! If you happen to have gel nails and you hate the regrowth, you know, the part where it gets like... You can see your nail and then you can see the bulge of the gel or the acrylics or whatever. Um, my mm, nail technician uh, suggested me to use the LCN nail hardener or sorry super hardener because it creates like the illusion that it's smooth and there there is no uh, gap between your nail and the fake nails so yeah I've been using it and I'm not sure yet about it but hopefully it works and what else Muff is doing well in case you don't know who Muff is, yeah, I know, you're there. Muff is my canary bird, my extra domesticated canary bird who believes it's a human or that I'm a canary bird, whichever way. Wh what do you think? Am I a canary bird? Or are you a human? You don't know? Yeah, it doesn't know right now. Anyways. Um, I would love to know what you've been up for Easter or these past weeks when I've been missing. So let me know in the comments down below because I really love interacting with you guys. That's the whole reason why I put up videos. And yeah. Oh, in case you didn't know, there is a poll on my blog, which is about what the next video should be about. Um, I know... I'm a little bit behind with it, but basically it's a video that you get to pick or choose on the topic and there is a poll on my blog, so I'll leave the link down below and yeah, I hope you're all doing great and enjoying springtime. I know, I know, allergies, I know I have them, they're not nice, but regardless, we're getting a bit of sun, right? Anyways, if you're new, oh sorry. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. And if you like this video, then give it a thumbs up. You can also give it a thumbs down. Yeah, <laughs> doesn't bother me if you don't like this video. Anyways, thank you very much. Bye bye.